Welcome to my channel please like and subscribe, so you will be the first to view latest informations. Washington, 15 months after Donald Trump left town, the crown jewel of his unprecedented and out in the open corruption schemes as president is disappearing as well, with his namesake lodge closing down and changing hands. Trump International Hotel, just down the road from the White House, was for four years the area where both home and overseas lobbyists mingled with administration officials, with each dime of earnings from the many millions of dollars spent on food, alcohol and lodging there flowing immediately into Trump's non-public financial institution accounts. It is incredible that simply a few blocks from the White House, Trump opened a conduit for corrupt money to go with the flow from distinctive interests, which includes overseas governments, into his personal pockets, stated Norm Eisen, an ethics legal professional in the Obama White House. No preceding president created such an association to individually earn from entities searching for the desire of his government branch, which with the cooperation of most of his appointed cabinet officers in making the hotel, its featured restaurant and its lobby bar the administration's de facto storefront for access. Journalist Zach Everson, who made the resort his place of expertise, stated that of the 38 cabinet participants who served underneath Trump over the path of his four years, 29 have been considered at least once at the hotel. Treasury Secretary Stephen Nutchen and Small Business Administration Chief Linda McMahon went as far as to stay at the lodge early on, while searching for everlasting housing. From daughter and son-in-law Ivanka Trump and Jared Kushner to National Security Council group of workers to Vice President Mike Pence to Pentagon officers to individuals of the cabinet the team Citizens for Responsibility and Ethics in Washington logged 499 separate visits to the lodge using public reporting and social media. These humans have been gaining access basically due to the fact they have been making repayments to him, stated Robert McGuire, the crew researcher accountable for monitoring Trump's businesses. There was in no way a night time when it was no longer packed. Never. Exactly how much cash Trump took in via his lodge is not possible to understand from public sources. Trump refused to launch his tax returns throughout his candidacy and presidency, breaking for a long time of precedent, and the hotel's enterprise documents are private. While it is possible to decide from lobbying disclosure varieties how much any given entity spent to persuade Trump's government branch, there is no way to understand how plenty was spent at 1100 Pennsylvania Avenue. Trump's household commercial enterprise did flip over a complete of $459,320 to the U.S. Treasury, that it claims was earnings generated by way of overseas entities, an attempt to assuage critics who pointed out that the Constitution bars a president from accepting repayments from overseas powers. But that determined depends on calculations by the Trump Organization, which stays beneath investigation in New York State for its commercial enterprise practices.